I'm here in Kyiv now where you can see the first snows of winter have started to fall and the temperatures are dropping sharply. This is just the beginning of the winter. It's only going to get colder and darker as the days draw in. That's why our next project is focused on trying to keep people warm. We've seen a lot of damaged houses here but people are still living in them. So imagine if you've got a hole in the roof or your windows are blown out, you're going to get very cold very quickly. So the aid that we're bringing in is doing three things. The first is the outside of the house. So we're providing some wooden struts and hard wearing tarpaulins to fix the roof, some clear plastic sheeting and sealing foam to seal up those windows, keep all the cold air out and try and keep the warmth in. But we're also providing solid wood burning stoves and a supply of firewood. Next thing is to keep the people warm. So we're bringing in high thermal blankets, also some winter clothing. And then the final element is solar lights because we have rolling blackouts here. The power infrastructure has been badly damaged in recent attacks. So those solar lights as the winter days draw in are gonna become increasingly important.